ladies and gentlemen of the class of 67, buy your own bitch. If I could offer you only one tip for the future, bitches would be it. The long-term benefits of bitches have been proved by scientists. Whereas the rest of my advice has no basis more reliable than my own meandering experience. I will dispense this advice now. Enjoy the power and beauty of frogging. Oh, never mind. You will not understand the power and beauty of frogging because you're only a young'un of 53. Come by! Don't worry about spooking taddies. Or worry, but know that worrying is as effective as girdling the raft in a beetle chaser's spangwanger. Away! Don't be reckless with other people's spawn whistles. And don't put up with people who are reckless with yours. Slap dash! Don't waste your time on the outrun. Or come to that, the fetch. Sometimes you're ahead, sometimes you're behind. Keep your old Jaspers down. Throw away unwanted wellies. Everybody's free. Everybody's free. Everybody's free. Maybe you'll marry. Maybe you won't. Maybe you'll have children. Maybe you won't. Maybe she'll have your dinner on the table at five o'clock. And maybe she won't. Maybe she'll leave you and you'll have to get a cleaner. And maybe she won't. Never take too wide an outrun on the jirrup hurdle. Always wear your daps in the coldy hole. Accept certain truths. Prizes will rise... Brilton Fnur will always be a contender for the anus all, and Bodge Snart will shaft you given half a chance. Advice is a form of nostalgia. While still a young ponder of 64, Diddy Diddly Tixie Neely Binch said, A fool's rush on the shedding ring is kamikaze frogging. Everybody's free to disregard the scoffster, but trust me on the bitches.